I'm you're really interrupting my customers and my employees. How am I interrupting them? Because you're in a place where you're not supposed to be. What's your name, man? That's, I told you, you don't worry about What's it. What's your name? I want to file a complaint. You don't. Little Joey the Crackhead, when are you going to learn? Nobody, and I do mean nobody, cares what you want. You or Buffalo with a camera or that tramp stamp you got tattooed of a crackhead on your neck. Good morning, Roughnecks, and soon to be Roughnecks. Wrangler here. And in this one, everybody's favorite bi-coastal crackhead, Joey Surreal is decided that he wants to go back and hit post offices. He's one of these idiots that thinks that a post office is government property. And a post office is not government property. It is a business. It is a private business. It is not a government entity because it is not budgeted by Congress. They are sustained by the fees that they charge for delivering the mail, okay? It is a private business. It's just regulated by the government, much like the way that the stock market is. Do you think that you could walk into the lobby of Merrill Lynch pulling this bullshit? No. Enjoy, folks. What's going on, everybody? I'm back at it at beautiful Fort Myers, Florida. Not one cloud in the sky. And um, we're at this post office over here. And we're gonna take some video here. See that respect my rights to record. I'm out with Chuck Bronson. You guys subscribe to my friend over there. Um, he came to have my back. Well, here's my question. If you're not doing anything wrong, and what you're doing is 100% legal, then why do you need another loser like Chuck Bronson to have your back? Huh, fat boy? I'm just going to keep working. How you doing, sir? Excuse me, let me just read this real quick. Um, ding, 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 ding. I don't think it's illegal. Damn, you should never drink the bong water. <laughs> well, seeing as how the law recognizes that property as private property, you don't have a right to do what you're doing. In fact, the policies on the wall, the same policies that you try to use as a go-to to justify your trespassing, those same policies say that you cannot film, video, record, photograph without express written permission from the postmaster. And you do not have it. So, these people are trying to cause a disturbance already? We got cam backs. Yo, what's wrong with that lady, dude? She doesn't want to be on a 50-year-old crackhead's YouTube channel so you can make money off her image illegally? This lady's rude. What's what's the deal where you re being recorded, dude? Look at this lady. Oh, my God. Excuse me. That, that's crazy. Um, is Dude, if you rushed up to my mama like that, I'd put you on your fat ass. Are you the supervisor, sir? Yes, sir. All right, can I have a word with you here? That's fine. Take your time. All right. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I don't mean to bother you or interrupt right now. I just need her name. This lady's very unprofessional. She can't be acting like that in front of me. Well, you also can't have the camera in the face. I don't. are allowed in the building, but you can't be up to up close. How, All how? people doing business. No, you can't be over there. You have to be on the other side. What's of your side. name, man? You don't worry about that. I have a right you to know be the here rules. The okay. So why did you I rude? deny you? But, but why you, you can't be in front. I'm, I was there. I can't no, be you there. can't be there because people are conducting business. I'm not trying to record nobody's you, information we, or you people. You can't prove that. Okay, well, this is a you, public area. Behind the slide, you can I be there. I you come. can't be near the window line. You can go behind the slide. That's where you can go. Not gonna happen. No, not gonna happen. 
gonna happen. <laughs> Not yeah, but if he did that, he wouldn't be able to start shit with your people and your customers for clickbait. I come to take video of the facility in, a pub no. in public areas. You Hold take on. the video over there, not here. People are conducting business. I'm going to stand there yes, right now. And I will call the police. Go ahead. Make sure you call the postal police. Well, we will. We'll all call right, cool. off. So you're telling me I can't stand right here? Behind the slide. I just need People her are name. doing business. You don't need her name. Shut your mouth when you're talking to me. There's a public employee. You don't need How her do name. I file a complaint on her? You don't need her name. My camera wasn't in her, in her face. You don't need her name. I was back here, and I was going to get in you line to buy a stamp. Here. You belong over there. Who are you to tell me where to stand in a public area? I'm going to go with he's the postmaster, you fucking deadbeat. What's your name, man? You don't worry about what my you name gotta is. You're going to be rude like that. Why are you rude like this? I'm not being rude. You're being rude. Being you're rude. interrupting my customers and my employees. How am I interrupting them? Because you're in a place where you're not supposed to be. I'm not you can be, be here, here, but you can't be right in front of the business line, the, the, the window I was line. right here. That's in the window. This side is the window line of that slide. So I can't be right there? What's your name, That's man? A, I told you, you don't worry about What's it. What's your name? I want to file a complaint. You're a bitch. You don't worry about it. Can I get his name and her name? I'm you not don't leaving. worry about it. I'm not leaving. You're being extremely rude. Oh, you're being extremely no, rude not because you're not very listening. Calm. I'm allowing I'm you to you. And, and do your First Amendment right. Okay, so why are you being but rude and look bad in front of my camera? wrong. How am I doing it wrong? I just explained it to I you. Come obviously, here. you don't listen. Obviously, so now you're in the way of a customer behind me. Obviously, you're grumpy and rude. Why don't you get back to work? You're no, why rude. don't you get a job? Not gonna happen. No, not gonna happen. <laughs> not. I can answer that for you, sir. The reason that he won't get a job is, one, with his resume or lack thereof. He's never had a real job. So he has no experience whatsoever to offer any company. Uh, second, with all of his arrests, for crack possession, again, he if he gave you a pre-employment drug screen, the son of a bitch would probably glow in the dark. Not to mention, he's a lazy 50-year-old asshole who lives on his granddaddy's car and the couch and wrecks his granddaddy's car. This no is more. my job, and okay. I guarantee you'll probably be more than you. Yeah, okay. Expose well, seeing as how you're more than likely running dope from Tucson to Miami, yeah, you probably do. Government corruption. I need to talk like to this. somebody. Yeah, government What's corruption. What's the name? You're, I'm standing right here. No, you're not. Look, go over there. Look. Standing right here. Your rules and regulations is right there, dude. And again, do you have express written permission from the postmaster to film? I got rude as hell, dude. And again, show me the federal law that requires he kiss your ass. Anyway, guys, let's skip ahead to when the cops show up. What's going on, man? I don't know. You tell me. They, the employees called and said you were here recording, and they just want to know what's up. Can I show you something? Yeah. What's your name, Ambassador? Smith, 17135. My, my name is Joey. Good to meet you, man. Cool. Is this about Post 7? Yeah. Do you know about it? Yeah. All right. As soon as I came in here, this lady freaked out, started yelling. I don't want to be recorded. Put that cardboard there. I just want, I just stepped over here. There was no service going on at the time right there. Mm -hmm. This lady was out to lunch. Came and walked around. I wanted to buy a stamp. Oh, oh shit. shit! Oh, oh shit! shit! She extremely caused a disturbance. I'm not, yeah, okay. I come with no ill will. And then this gentleman, I'm trying to file a complaint on her. At least get her name. This guy has an extremely horrible attitude. The word Dilly Gap. That's Mel D. I-L-L-I-G-I-M Dilly Gap And it means Do I look like I give a fuck? I got it on film telling me that I can't stand here. This okay. is a public space. There was no business being conducted at the time. Now there is. Now I won't. Can you step over for me just so she can... Can you step outside? Yeah. I'll explain. Okay. Um, now you're being fed a lot of lies. So I'm, I'm lies? My camera doesn't oh. lie, sir. Yeah, but... The camera's being controlled by a crackhead. Crackheads lie. I'll talk to him, but yeah. do you want to wait inside or outside? It don't matter. Um, Are you willing to wait outside and I'll talk to him real quick? You can talk to him. It don't matter. I mean, right. I would like to see. catch you. I, I would like to record you, letting right. him know that I'm, I have a right to record here. Yeah, you're good. We'll go inside behind the wall. Right, I'll, I'll yeah. come right back yeah. to you, all right? You're saying I'm lying. My camera doesn't lie, sir. I'll come right back to you. All right, cool. Appreciate that. All right, I'm, back. I'm so sorry, man. I couldn't hear you. What was your yeah. first name? My name is Joey. Joey? Yeah. Okay, here, let me come around this thing. Cool. I'm also trying to get a stamp, but <laughs> I don't think so. What, well, then why didn't you buy the stamp when you were illegally at the counter recording? I'm trying to get a stamp too. Oh, okay. But they called you guys, so I just 
gonna yeah, wait. You're, you're good, man. So just so you know, in Appreciate transparency, it. like he didn't, he didn't like hype it up or anything. So he explained to me that at some point you had approached the counter. You alleged that you're making a transaction to buy the poster, the stamp. Yeah. And for whatever reason, uh -huh. it made the redhead woman uncomfortable. I'm sure her reaction may have been a little adverse. Um, however, that's not true. Uh, yeah. I, you know, she you know, immediately started when I was I walked in and stand right there, taking video of that. Not out of the way at the, at the oh. counter. I don't, I'm not gonna go up there. Mm. Y'all smell that? I smell bullshit. And she just didn't want to be recorded. She flipped out. Oh, I don't want to be with you. She ran to the back. Extremely rude. You know, then that's when he came out. I, I, so the supervisor was behind her and the supervisor was trying to let her know he could record, not the guy you were speaking to, the other guy. Okay. Not the guy, not the big guy, not yeah. the mean guy. And saying that I have a right to record it. He was explaining it to her. She still was extremely rude. And I told the supervisor, can I have a word with you? Mm -hmm. In the slide right here. So I was waiting and then he opened the door with the other mean, with the other rude guy. So then that's when he, he was extremely rude, dude. I come to get a stamp. Oh my God, I care so little, I almost passed out. But you didn't try to get a stamp. And in fact, until the cops showed up, you didn't even mention needing a stamp. Record the building and I'm out the door, dude. Yeah, you're good. That's it. So Very peacefully and respectful, dude. You're good. And you're, and you're being chill with me most Yeah, of so absolutely. And I, I did ask him about the, the complaint you said. How so, do I do that? Um, I asked him about that. And he said they don't really have a form for public to them because it's internal. To go I actually, the house body. I rephrase that. I know how to do it, but oh, I'm just okay. saying, because this is federal, it's different. Yeah. I guess, you know, I guess you're confused, Joey. And I guess, you know, you probably did a down pipe hit before you came into the post office. But that officer, he doesn't work for the feelings police. You may know more. I genuinely don't know. But he told me you'd have to call the 1-800. I they, got it. They, don't, they only let they do it internally. Yeah, that's true. But I just wanted her name. That's mainly why I wanted it. Are you it. waiting to go up front? No, I'm waiting for you to move the truck so I can get Oh, that. I'm sorry. Here, give me... Go move ahead, man. Go quick. ahead. I'll wait for you. Thank you. Sorry, I moved my, moved my car for him. So what... You're good. So, I mean, ultimately... Um, so I get back to you. So, yeah, as far as the complaint goes... Um, yeah. He had said that typically they only do it internally. That's fine. If I just you know the way, then great. Yeah. Um, if you just want to buy the stamp, obviously I can't tell you no. That's no, I know. I know. Just so you know, their initial concern was whether it be perceived or genuine. Their yeah. concern was that you were walking up with the intention of recording people's information. No. But I get it. Yeah, That's get not it. why I'm here. Yeah, That's number it. one. And number two, it's not illegal to record that is what I do with the information. Number three, I have policies to follow on my platform. I'm yeah, not here too. for that. Oh, that's why you've been getting your channels nuked and demonetized and your videos taken down because you follow the policies. Oh, okay. That makes sense then. Are you, like, I'm here to record the government and my transaction and the building in public areas. Period. You're good, bro. Are you, is it YouTube, <laughs> Facebook? Yeah, like Somewhere like that. Fair enough. Okay. Yeah. Well, you, so you know, man, you're allowed, you know, you're allowed to record in the building. Of course. I'm not accusing you of going anywhere you should It's extremely rude, dude, because I have a camera. That's all it is. Probably. A lot of people, they don't like being on camera. I'm on camera all day. Man. I know. Whatever. But you guys are public servants. So are they. They can't act like that towards us. We have a right to record them while you guys are working on your official capacity. This is why I'm doing this. By my stamp, my people told me to come to this post office. I've mm -hmm. had bad reviews here. But again, who has authorized you to investigate anything, especially a federal business? Because of my, my viewers that come here in this area, this is why I come here. That's it. And this is exactly what I get. And then they want to twist words around that I can't be here and I can't be there in a public area. They just don't want me to be. They just don't okay. like me recording. That's all it is, bro. And it's ridiculous. Well, I tell you what, Joey, if we get them in here, you can buy your stamp. And are you willing to bounce after that? Well, yeah. I, I, when I'm done with my story, I'll bounce. Well, okay. After you guys bounce, I'll bounce. Okay, well, let's That's get your it. stamp at least. Why are you gonna go, well, gonna go with me to buy a stamp? If they have the open line, because I don't want them to call right they away. Can't they can't do that, bro. They, they can't. Mm -hmm. Over a protected activity, they can't do that, dude. Ooh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to go ahead and sort of disagree with you there. But again, yes, they can. Even if that was government property, in the sense of a, say, a federal agency it would still fall under the forum doctrine and that would make that a limited to non-public forum. Yes, it is accessible to the public, but only for services at which they're designed to provide. So your loitering around in there doesn't count. I'm going to buy my stamp. Well, I can't tell you not to follow me either. They can't tell you you can't buy a stamp. Yeah, I appreciate you being cordial though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So there's a lot of music here. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's all I'm doing, dude. I don't care about all that. I get, if I get public in, private information by any chance, it gets flagged. Sure. I'm not with that. No, it gets flagged only if your victims report it, Joey. You know better. You know, you've done this enough. I'm sure you're familiar you with it. Even if it's there, you have to. Yeah, of course, bro. I'm not here for that. And then that's a lot of the excuse that these employees use in a lot of these places. Oh, private information. They just use that because they don't want to be recorded. That's the, they yeah, always use like, that same li line, you know? Seven, like, you, yeah. you, you basically can't just go beyond that wall. That's no, like, bro, I, I know. And you, know and you guys actually technically don't have their jurisdiction in this post office. Yes, they do, because your crime is a violation of Florida statutes on trespassing. Now, have you committed a crime involving the mail then the United States Postal Inspectors would have been dispatched to take care of it. Now, yes, those deputies do have the jurisdiction right now. They do. At least you have a signed agreement signed, but with, with the police department, with the county yeah, in here. The, yeah. yeah, just to let you know, though. No, but that's I, I know cool. That, yeah. supposed, I told them, if you're going to call the police, call the, call the postal police. Do the right thing. But you're being... He's allowed to record you. Thank you. But his only his only purpose is to buy a stamp and he'll leave. Okay, then if he wasn't in there to start shit, so that he gets a conflict and confrontation and cops for clickbait, then why didn't he buy the fucking stamp and then leave? Why did he turn something that should have taken ten seconds into half an hour? I just wanted to make sure that you, you educate them. That's the whole purpose. Yeah, make sure they get yeah cool okay well i got a question for you joey if they don't have jurisdiction to run you out of that building how is it they would have jurisdiction to give orders to the postal employees and this lady is she put the cardboard in her face she, she just may be uncomfortable with camera although unfortunately she doesn't have any public capacity she has no choice though uh, yeah, she does, Joey. It doesn't matter if she's in her work capacity. You're not allowed to publish her image for profit without her consent and you compensating her. And thank you for giving me the number of the post office. I will be instructing them today on how to get your bitch ass video taken down. Damn crackheads, I swear. No. I don't even own a checkbook, though. So. I buy quite a lot of them. Do you? Well, oh. pretty much. Yes, officer, he does because he's looking for a way to get around trespassing, which he does in every video. Another female officer came in here. Was that your partner? Yeah. Oh, that's okay. my partner. Cool, cool. Supervisor. Yeah, that's my sergeant there. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, cool. Um, yeah, can you tell... Uh, I got a video sitter behind me buying a stamp. Would you like to buy a book of stamps? No, or? just just one stamp. Yeah, probably because his debit card won't let him buy more than one stamp. How you doing today? I'm doing fine, sir. Thank you. Very, ni you? very nice attitude. What's your name? I'm not giving my name. Why not? You're doing so well. Because there is no law that requires her to give you your name so you can have your crackhead subscribers call and harass her because she didn't want to believe in your frauditing bullshit. But I will help them get your video taken down thank you public information i want to know who gave me such a great service and my people it's all right thank you it's going to be 68 cents sir all right 68 cents thank you oh wow he paid with a dollar bill i guess his a uh, checking account's overdrawn and he's using buffalo with a camera's proceeds from last night so no you don't want to give me your beautiful name bitch is a beautiful no, name sir, thank <laughs> no you. all right i'll leave my viewers to decide uh you can just how say professional that was. The person didn't want to give me give me your his her name, so that's it. <laughs> but when you work for the people and we ask, you sh it's your policy to identify. No, it's not. But it's okay. Thirty-two cents is your change. I appreciate sir. the service, oh, though. No problems. You sir. have a good day. Have a good see, sir. Right. Oh, so you actually, I don't even need that. I'm good. Ice. I'm good. You can, hey, you can use the. Um, I'm good. Survey. Oh, I, yeah, I'll just At put down that everything was perfect. <laughs> everything was perfect, but I didn't know who served me.
because it's none of your damn business. Long time. Yeah, it's all right. We've had a couple conversations. Yeah, that was a, that was a while. Now it's. Yeah. Anybody want to take bets on the reason that Sergeant knows who Joel Christian Lopez is? Is because he has busted him for possession of crack rock. Yeah. You know, appreciate you guys. Be honest with you, you look better than what she did then. I appreciate that. Straight now? Yeah. I'm not trying to be rude, but it, before yeah. it looked like you. Were, yeah, yeah. I was yeah, very, very, very much bit. struggling, bro. It's gonna be 18 months. Okay. No, 19 months. I've been clean. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Right. Good. And then good. I said to myself, "That's it, man. Yeah. I found God." Good. And I said, "I'm gonna start doing this successfully," and pretty much, it's working. Yeah successfully huh is that why you're running dope from tucson to miami anyway guys that's where we're gonna wrap it up on this one you know i give the officers you know i give them a c on this one because the postal inspector had every right to trespass this piece of trash he did the law says that he does poster seven says that joey needs to have written express written permission from the postmaster period and the officers don't understand that and that's fine because i don't they probably don't need to be up on federal code since they don't enforce federal law but the post office has right to trespass joey period end of story anyway guys it's wrangler i'm out of here i love y'all have a happy saturday